Well, hello everyone, I am Fracture, and this is Let's Play Divine Divinity on the PC. We're working our way out of this rather long, arduous dungeon. Where I, Oh, boy. Where am I located? Where's my little blue dot? Somewhere. Well, obvious. Oh, there I am. Way down there. And I'm just trying to find my way out. Um, no luck so far, although we did have a neat little side quest at the end of the previous video sort of went into this strange house house of weirdness that had us going through all sorts of strange doors and whatnot and to escape it you had to go to sleep and when you slept you actually got a decent amount of what experience. What the hell did that just do? And that probably would have saved me a lockpick because it probably would have opened this door here Okay, I think around the corner. I'm not sure where the next... Uh, yeah, this looks like a place we can go. Ah, some mana mushrooms. Yes! Uh, mini mana. Oh, I've already got... Is this going to be one of those mm, things where won't you, work with that. Yeah, you can't stack them. And unfortunately, even trying that wastes them. You notice I, I picked up a stack of two. And they're both mana, minor magic. But for some reason the game thinks they're different. So I tried to stack them and it uses up one of the potions to tell you that no, it doesn't work. You can't stack them. Another frustrating little side effect in this game. But I'm happy to say the glitches in this game tend to be just that. Frustrating little side effects and nothing major. Like with any old game though, I've heard lots of people have trouble just running the game. I grabbed my copy of GOG and it's done really well. I had a sound glitch, but the support forum on GOG got that resolved. Ooh, there we go, another. Well, that was worth finding. Shadows. Shadow Stevens. Metal belt. Ah, plus two to strength, some resistances. Metal shield, silver key. What's this metal shield? Plus two to sight. That's not that good for me, but it's got a good charm quality. At some point it's going to complain that I am carrying too much. Contains nothing, contains nothing. Hmm, <laughs> I wonder what that did. Yes! Monk's leather leggings, plus eight to magic, not gonna bother. Yeah, could use the lock picks. Now, metal shield. Armor 120, what's the one we've got? We've actually got a pretty nice one. Armor 290, lock pick plus one. More resistance to lightning. Boy, a lot of this stuff's pretty nice. Yeah, we can get rid of that. Armor 220, what is this? We've got plus one to agility, plus two to defense. Otherwise it's a basic. Yeah, this, we gotta wear this. And it's charm quality four too, that's a nice belt. And it needs some repairing. Oh, we're here waste a bunch of mana on stuff I can't repair. Yeah, none of these needed repairing. Oh well. That is slick, and I could add some of these, but I don't think I have any good ones at the moment. Strength bonus, constitution, constitution, resistance to lightning, and mana. So no. 
Nothing worth adding to that belt at the moment. Hmm, plus 4 to defense, plus 15 to vitality. And this is edgy and hearing. Armor 160, armor 160. Yeah, that's kind of promising. Electrifying heavy chain, armor 140, plus 4 to strength, plus 7 resistance to lightning. Eh. Plus 4 to intelligence, plus 3 to defense. And then, of course, all this stuff. I still feel kind of silly carrying around a whole suckling pig with me, but... Mushrooms, I don't know what white are. I want to go see what's up in this corner. Let's, uh, oh boy, six of one half dozen of the other. I think this might actually be a bit of a loop. skill of finding these long, endless dungeons, don't we? Now, why has that got a little... Bleh, what the heck's that? I'm here. Oh, uh, I must have to come around this way if I want to see that. And, of course, now I do. Now that I've spotted it. I cannot leave it unexplored. It's annoying. I want to leave it. I just, I don't care. It's of no interest to me. I don't want to go this way. Stop. Stop. Yeah, I much prefer the, the sword wielding guys over the poison throwing and that elixir golden ring I think we've been in there it doesn't look like it though now we have golden ring There's the spot we saw, and it's of no major importance. So not really worth the trip, and we can head back. Do you want to watch me run there, or shall I pause fraps? You want to watch me run there? Well, you know, whatever lights your candle, all right. You can't say I didn't ask. I think you're rather strange, though. There we are. Hope you enjoyed it. Pile of gold. 
Oh yeah, lock picks. Oh, three of them too. Need the lock picks. Especially when I'm too lazy to go looking for levers. Hmm, I wonder what that did. I uh, must have did this one. What the hell did that just do? Jeez, you think it might have opened the door on the other side of the room? <coughs> Thief's legger le legger leathings, yes, I'm sporting my new legger leathings, and it's not bad actually. Plus four to agility, plus twenty three to magic. I'll have to drop something. I'm carrying too much. Ah, let's eat an entire suckling pig. Uh, I didn't. I need to drop more. Ah, oh, look, some leather leggings I don't need. How's that? Perfect. Oh, would you look at that? That one's open now. But of course, there's no real purpose to coming in here. And it was a loop, that other room. All right. Somewhere. Out there is the exit to this endless dungeon. And the thought of that is what keeps me going. That at some point I'll have escaped this dungeon so that somebody else can throw me in another one. Oh, it's not locked. It's not locked! I like getting up close to the archers because they start kicking you. Oh, good. More mana and probably health, which means another difficult battle on my hands just around the corner, no doubt. I would have preferred they told you that barrel contains 114 items so that you knew it was gold. And not just an old rotten orange. Uh. No, no, I don't need to do that. I want to. be reminded. while I'm here. What the heck? Ooh, yeah, there was the place. Lots of dots. Let's go up here, though. Up and around the corner first, for some reason I want to do that. Or maybe not. Have we done that? Oh, I thought there was a path through here. That's what I was thinking of. No, okay. Well, onto the mob. Whatever that was a mob of. What the hell did that just do? Ah, spiders. Lots and lots of spiders. What did all these spiders eat? Eat. Oh, there's a door there. Okay. They weren't just trapped in sort of a dead end. to be a... Uh, sorry, forgot to kill you. Sorry about that. Sorry. Sorry. Yeah. 
Hmm. Levers aren't usually this far away, so it looks like that door doesn't have a lever. Is that my pyramid? Rogue's Long Dagger of Death. That looks like my pyramid. Pyramid. Why is it why is it red? Oh, you were red. Uh, uh, uh call me cynical and paranoid. Go on. Cynical and paranoid. Cynical paranoid. Uh but I don't like the looks of that. Well, before we go there, let me just go check out this corner down here. So there was no lever? I have to do this manually? Uh, Alright, well... Yeah, not worth it. I don't know how much lockpicks cost, but probably about 45 gold. Uh, oh, there's another spot I haven't completed yet. The reason I'm doing this is I think this might be a one-way thing. I, I don't know if I should pick up those pyramids or stand on the teleporter. extension I was expecting it to be. It. Rabbit's Royal Shield of the Herbalist. Alchemy plus one. Well, it's not worth carrying around a whole shield just to gain a plus one to alchemy for the rare times that I need it. I think my lockpick shield is probably more valuable. now becomes what was the per, uh, portal stone hmm that's interesting that might be all that that is for then portal that other portal stone may just lead to here which I can see I mean it takes you directly to the exit from fairly deep within the cave.
remember, is here. So, do I pick up these pyramids, or... No, nope, guess not. Well, unless you want the experience, I guess. Fine leather leggings. Armor 100, and uh, they're just your basic leggings. Chain gloves, resistance to spirit and lightning. Well, I wonder if you can continue to do this. Nope. They're not even clickable now. Okay, well, I guess it's clicking here. And yep, just brings you over here. All right. this mean we're actually out of the dungeon? Can it be? Good golly. There you are. I was beginning to think you'd never come out of that damn dungeon. Yeah, you and me both. I'd never have made it without your help, my little friend. But for you, I'd have... Um, but for you, I'd have left my moldering bones down there. Wow. Just doing my job, Squire. But, now I need you a favor from you. I have a turd stuck on my butt. Could you pull it off? Uh, your wish is my command, my furry master. Cut the sarcastic theatrics. Zandalor went to Stormfist Castle but never returned. I want you to go in there after him. Look, how can we rescue Zandalor if we don't know where he is? And how am I supposed to get into Stormfist Castle? I don't think they'll let me back in. They're just after Janice gave me the push. Lick, lick. I recall Zandalor telling me a long time ago about ancient crypts below the castle. There are old artifacts are stored. That's probably where he went, and that's almost certainly where he's trapped. It's not like Zandalor... It is not like Zandalor at all to stay away that long. How on earth am I going to get into those crypts if they exist? Oh, they do exist, but I don't have knowledge about the secret passages leading in and out of Stormfist Castle. There are sewers under Riverton, though. Oh boy, yes, do we ever know that. I reckon if water can get out of Stormfist Castle, people can get in as well. I've heard as well that if the sewers are crowded with vermin and aggressive lizard people, I might be roaming there forever. If Sandalore is really in danger, we don't have time to waste. Perhaps there is another way. Rumors say that Thieves' Guild can get in everywhere. Even in the castle. Great! And how do we get there from here? Pass your map down here, and I'll at least mark an entrance to the sewers. If you want to find out where the secret entrance to the crypts under Stormfist Castle is, you can look for it yourself, or contact the Thieves' Guild in Verdistus. Those sneaks know every bolt hole and shortcut in town. They usually have a man on duty at the Ducal Inn. Very well, I'll give it a try. Okay, so we marked a lot of entryways in the sewers, so I think I might do that. Oh, what's this? No, that annoying cat. She'll cook its heart and eat it. And as for you, Marked One, you shall not leave this place. Rise, rise from the graves and don't let him leave. Oh, good. Yeah, not too effective. Good experience, though. I know you're in a difficult time when you're searching for corpses to kill. That stupid poison. Still bothersome. Lots of 
mushrooms. I suppose I really should be using them. We really did tear through a lot of potions in that. Brilliant! That run through with that eyeball demon thing. Wow. Something tells me that's kind of glitched as well, if you look at how often he's casting that. I'm sure that's a glitch with the... probably running it on a faster computer or something like that. Well, 14 resistance to poison. Well, I'll have to drop something. I'm carrying too much. Okay, maybe we won't carry it along with me. Yeah, let's get rid of this. It does have a nice charm quality, I'll though. I'll have to drop something. I'm carrying too much. Ah, whatever. Actually, you know what? Now that we've completed that, I'm seeing we're getting close to 30 minutes, so I will say I thank you for watching and I thank you for listening. I encourage you to leave comments, suggestions, or infantile abuse. I promise I read it all. And if you like my videos, don't forget to subscribe to my channel or give me the thumbs up. We'll see you in the next one, guys. Have a good one. Cheers.